Hello and welcome back to another video session. This series is all about third-party applications for your Mac. And for this particular episode, we're going to talk about something very simple. Uh, I think a lot of you would have used Microsoft Paint at one time or another in the past on your Windows computer. And you'd be wondering, on a Mac, how can I find something like MS Paint? Well, no worries. we got software that I can recommend. It's free, open source, more or less, called Paintbrush. So, Again, this is a third-party software, so disclaimer is at your own risk. <laughs> Switch is not responsible if anything would go wrong. Having said that, let's get started. So, where do we get Paintbrush? Go to Google, search for Paintbrush for OS X, and you'll be coming to this website, paintbrush.sourceforge.net. So this is where you can get something so simple. As you can see, it's very straightforward, <laughs> similar to Microsoft Paint for Windows. And when you download it, the icon really brings back memories. Paintbrush. So you should, of course, make sure that this application is placed inside your application folder. Now that I have that, you can always add it back. Oops. You can always add it back right over to your dock. So now they have it, when you launch Paintbrush, okay, you will always warn you that this is not from an identified developer. Now to get through that, right click on it and open. This allows you to open it and you will work in the future as well. Now you can start opening and creating your own images similar to MS Paint and you get all the usual tools. You can draw, you can erase, you can do shapes, colors, everything that you need, even text. with all the fonts that you need it. Okay. So you'll notice that this is pretty much a very simple but very straightforward editing application. So try it out. Paintbrush for Mac, available for free, and it's used like MS Paint for Windows. Something useful for your Mac.